This is the Lightphone 3, and today we're going to take a look at all of the applications or tools, as they call it, that are available on the device. Let's get right into it. The first one here is called Phone, and Phone is where you'll do all of your calling and messaging. Of course, you can dial out any phone number as you would on any other phone, and you can also search through your contacts and scroll through your contacts, as well as add new ones and compose a group message to multiple contacts. I actually have my iPhone set up so that if I message my phone number from my light phone, it'll actually send a message to the recipient as if it came from my iPhone. And I also have my iPhone set up so that any messages sent to my iPhone will get forwarded to my light phone. And I also have another shortcut that lets me get the weather forecast for the given zip code. Let me know in the comments if this is something that you would be interested in seeing a video about. Next up is the alarm. Nothing special here, you can set up an alarm. You can add multiple alarms. And of course you can delete them. Next up is album. Album is where you'll be able to see all of the photos and videos that you took with your light phone and you can actually even forward them to your email right from here or send them as a message. Calculator is your standard calculator. It's pretty basic, there are no advanced operations available here, which is your basic addition, subtraction, division, and multiplication. Next up is calendar. You can add new events here on the Light phone itself. Light also has a dashboard, which is a website where you can go and add different calendars such as your iCloud calendar or Google calendar. You also have a month view as well as a today view and you can scroll through different days. The camera is pretty basic. The shutter button is on the top right. You can also switch to a video mode as well as a selfie camera. Next up is directions. It does offer walking, driving, and public transit for directions. After 800 feet, turn right onto South Avenue. It features a full map with pinch and zoom. as well as a list of directions. Directory lets you look up a business or a category, and then from there you can see a phone number and a list of hours for any of the entries. From here you can either call them or get directions to the destination. After 800 feet, turn right onto South Avenue. Next up is Hotspot. Pretty straightforward. You can change the name of the network as well as the password to whatever you would like. Next up is music. You can upload songs on the light dashboard as it says here, which is the website I mentioned earlier, and from there it will sync down to your light phone automatically. There is a pretty basic notes app here. You can of course write a text-based note, and you can also record voice memos as well. Next up is podcasts. This is also something that you have to set up on the light dashboard. On the Light Dashboard, you can subscribe to various podcasts and they will sync to your Light Phone 3 as new podcast episodes are released. There's also a timer where you can quickly choose hours, minutes, and seconds. However, if you want a very specific time, you can also just type one in manually. Say maybe I only want 47 seconds. That is not available with the seconds as it only goes by 15 second increments. Lastly, we have the settings. Here you can turn on airplane mode, change your notification settings, adjust some of your preferences.
forwarding will automatically forward any pictures or links that you receive over text to your email. Here you can rearrange your tools. If you want to transfer your pictures via the cable, you can change the USB to media transfer mode. One thing I forgot to mention is that when you're on the lock screen, you can actually press the circular button at the bottom there, and that will take you right into the phone tool. Let me know down in the comments if I should make a video on how to set up your iPhone so that it forwards all of the messages to your light phone, and you can reply from your light phone as if it came from your iPhone, and other tips and tricks like getting weather forecasts. And that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and subscribe for more Lightphone 3 content.